Hey everybody, welcome back to the Whoop Den for another episode of 3D Crystal Puzzles. And yeah, today I'm actually speaking into my webcam. I just got one from a friend of mine. Uh, we're going to try to make things a little bit different for you today. Uh, we're going to try to make it to where you can actually see the puzzle pieces as I'm putting them together. Uh, so this is going to go clip to my hat. And uh, we're going to go ahead and just try to get into this. We're going to be taking a look at the 3D Crystal Puzzle teddy bear today. And I'm going to try to keep things as clear as possible. Um... I do have a uh, vision uh, adjuster on this thing, so we're going to try to keep things as clear as possible for you guys. But let's go ahead and just try to get into this here, okay? So let me just turn this around here. One sec. There we go. Okay. And we're going to adjust the camera here. There we go. And so here is the puzzle right here. It is the 3D Crystal Puzzle Teddy Bear. It is a level one. And I'm going to just adjust a little bit more so that we can keep this nice and clear here. There we go. All right. So <clears throat> today I'm going to be taking a look at this guy here. Um, or girl, it is pink. Uh, but uh, we're going to go ahead and just get right into this here what it comes looking like there you just all these little pieces here go ahead and there we go, tear that right over so what I like to do and what you guys don't usually see is normally I will pile them up but I've started doing something a little different I actually find these little pieces here kind of set them aside got these the legs it looks like right there and I'm sorry if I'm moving this around. Like I said, this is a trial thing right here. We're just kind of taking a look, see what this is going to be like here, see if it helps out a little more. But then I'm going to just, I try to start separating them out by size and what I think is going to go uh, well together. It looks like this here, this piece here is going to be the base right there. So I'm going to go ahead and just kind of keep that aside. It's possible that it's the base. It's not necessarily there. Right there is the all the legs right there. And it looks like I got here an ear right there. Oh, puppy dog sees somebody. That right there, that is the base right there. So let me just take a quick, real quick moment here and take a look. That looks like it's actually supposed to be the opposite side. Well, we'll figure it out, but that's either the base or the head. I think that's the base. That is the base. Okay. So we're going to get our things sorted out here, kind of get an idea. Sorry, I got a cord connected to this thing, so it's kind of difficult here. Just kind of set everything aside. I've tried a few different things like process of elimination um, and a couple of other things, but this seems to be working the best, so I'm just going to kind of stick with it. Um, let me see here. Right there, right there. Also keeps things organized, so we're just gonna do that. And I'm gonna get that out of there. It's a little something you can do with that right at the end if you want. Put little hearts on it or something. Just like right there, you know. You got the eyeballs. You got some some different kinds of eyeballs. You got the nose. You got the hearts. Looks like little ones, big ones, bow ties, uh, even a star if you want. So. All right, well, we're going to go ahead and we're just going to keep sorting for a minute. And at times, I may actually get them out of the packages, and I may actually sort them out real quick ahead of time just so that you guys uh, don't have to wait for me to do this. But we're going to go ahead and just kind of keep sorting things here. Looks like I got another ear here. We're going to go ahead and set that up there. I just adjust real quick. There we go. So right there. We're going to do this on two separate sides. I think I'm going to probably end up doing this right in the middle here. There we go. Right there. I'll just do it like that. Smaller one's going to come up over here. Okay. So we got the basis layout here, which is... Let me get this thing set up here. Basically, it's gonna look like that right there. And I hope that this is working for you guys. I really do. Um, I'm just kind of scooch everything over a little more because my camera's giving me a little bit of trouble here. 
I'm really hoping this works out because this is probably going to be one of the ways I'm going to uh, start showing you guys this here. So let's see. So from what I've seen, this is not the base. It looks like this here is going to be the base. So we're going to kind of start with that. Move some stuff around here. There we go. Okay, so there's that. Now we're just going to kind of move from there. I'm looking for a little guy here with a, what looks like here, a little nubby piece there. Oh, okay, let's just take a quick look here. I got here. That's not it. Kind of a base formation here. No, that is that is the head. That actually is going to go right here. Just like so. Because that's going to cap off the anchor. So I'm just going to set that over here. Okay. Looking for the base. Looking for littler guys right now. Because, like I said, we got this right here. I already found our first one. Now we just got to keep moving. Where, oh, where is this little guy gone? I'm sorry it took me so long to, to get back into the swing of things. Like I said, I've been out and injured and trying to get back into the swing of things. It's been kind of rough. There it is right there. See that? Right there, you see that little dude right there on the back side of this thing? It's actually right there on the very edge. So we're going to go ahead. It's not the first piece it's looking like, but it's a start. So I'm going to go with that. And this is actually just a tad bit confusing because I'm not understanding why, where these guys are. It's a little strange if you ask me. That looks like the, the nose right there. You see that? The little eyeballs and stuff. It's kind of clear, so it's a little hard to see, but I'm going to set that aside. That's a part of the head. I'm going to set it right there. Okay. Here come the puppies. Do, 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 do. What we got going on here? No. Nope. No. That looks close, but I'm really not seeing what I'm wanting to see. Okay, we're looking for a kind of a goofy looking piece right now. It's going to have that like kind of like right there. So that is very interesting. Go ahead and get these little guys together here. Is that seriously? No. From the looks of things, I'm looking for ones that don't jump around. Um, it looks like I'm looking for ones that are going to kind of, I don't know, very interesting. It sure is. Hmm. Get back here. I didn't think this was going to start out so difficult. So maybe, you know, I did not think about it. It's starting out difficult because I'm not dealing with the right pieces. These are the legs. Right there. Now for me to be able to tell 
what leg they are. There we go. Boom! We got some legs, people. Okay. So that means that to keep them in place, we're going to put, if you remember this little, little dude here, I'm going to put that in there. There we go. Okay, now we're just going to continue. Do, 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 do. Where are you? No, that's not that. I'm looking for a small but significant piece here. That looks about right, just on the wrong side. What is that? Y'all see that? A little nub right there. I'm wondering about that. Huh, that must be a, a slot for the ear, so I'm just going to set that one aside. Balaquat. Got my puppy dog all itching herself all up over there. Dun, dun, dun. I love her to death. She gets she gets talked to and comes walking out here. Hey, what I do, Dad? There we go. Dang, wrong side again. I know what I'm looking for. It's just something kind of like that, but it's got to be smaller. I don't understand. It's not this one. This looks like the other ear piece. So we're going to set that aside over there. Hmm. Very interesting. Looking for the other side of this. Had everything kind of sorted out, but... You guys know puzzles. Looks like that there. Right there. Looks like that is a part of the face, so we're going to put that over there. Maybe. No. Smaller. Got to go smaller. No. I do not know what that's all about. That's interesting. Yeah, that's interesting. Hmm. It's even got a little slot on that end. Well, so far, not much progress, but progress. Let's just keep going here. This is what it takes. This is what I go through every time. A little bit of patience, a little bit of caring. Is that no? I know eventually I'm just like gonna be like, really, it's been there the whole time. So messed up. Where are you? Nope. It's going to be kind of a longer piece. Like that one? That feels right. Every so often you get a piece that feels right, but then it gives you trouble. So that's the basis for it right there. And I think I just found it. It has got to be this guy right here. There he is. See, told you. He'd been sitting there the whole time. No. No. So now we get to look for a bigger kind of piece. Just taking a look around here. Yes, no, maybe so. Right there. 
Little dude. It was just a little thing, too. Look at that. See if I can dull the lights a little bit there. Okay. Sorry about the camera swaying and everything. Like I said, we're trying something new here. I gotta get a better look at this. It looks like there's a tail. I mean, but that that's gotta be this guy here. See, because here's the ears. That's gotta be this guy. It's gotta be. Oh, get back on there. Down there. This thing. Come on. Get on it. Keep moving my head around trying to figure out what the best spot for this camera is. So that's going to be it right there. But we're going to have to find a way to tag that guy on there. Oh, we need the tail. Where is hmm? There's gonna have to be another another piece right there. Had it sitting over here because it had one of those funky pieces on it. It's got to be that one. So we're gonna test this theory. happening so there's another piece that I gotta find that is not correct but that is god darn close no. okay we're gonna back up a little bit computer's gonna come in a little bit I'm just going to move over a little bit. There we go. That's a lot better. So we are still moving on this. Again, another one kind of close. Probably the first time I've had that many come so close. Too small. Is that it? That is not it. That can't be it. Doesn't go all the way out. Candidate. Just gonna put them out there as a candidate. Hmm. 
That's got to be it. Okay, so now we're looking for a bigger piece. Kind of like that one right there. Hmm. We're going to be looking for a double sider. Right here is a littler piece. I'll see if I can bring it closer. There we go. So it's double sided right there between my fingers. Okay, so. It's going to have one big edge and one little edge. I think I got gotcha. you. I think. Nope. Every time I think, I'm wrong. <laughs> time to stop thinking. Just do. Hmm. I'll tell you what, man. Some of these things are making me for sure wonder. I mean, like, you get some all the time that make you sit there and think, you know, do I got the right one? Is it missing a piece? For sure, boy, I'm having those moments today. You know what I'm going to need? I'm not lying either. I think I'm going to get a tripod. <laughs> hmm. That there is just about right. Used to be a little bigger though. And I need to quit doing that. There we go. Stiffening up. No. Okay, so no, no. No. Again, I do apologize about being all over the place. We're still trying something new here. Okay, there we go. Found it. Okay, so we're going to be looking at this guy. And what we were looking for is actually dropped on the table. Okay, so it's going to be right here. See them two edges right there? That little dude there and then this big dude right here? That's what we wanted. So there's that. Oh, get in there. There we go. Hmm, now we just gotta locate. I don't know why I didn't have that set aside, like way out there. There we go. The tail, the tail is going on.
There we go. Looking for kind of a big piece now. Right there it is. And his tail came out. Too many of those. I caught it. Too many of those happen, and I'm just going to glue his butt together. There we go. That seems about right, but it's wobbling in there. That's not it. Because its stomach's hanging over. Well, that is it. It's just... Feels weird. Hmm. Okay, I had to think there for a moment. Nope. If you can't tell, I'm eyeballing all the pieces right now. Trying to focus on my next one. <laughs> there we go. All right. Try again. Nope. Man, it's not leaving me many choices. Tail's going aside for now. It will be glued in. Hmm. Kind of long. This guy. I think we just tried this one. I'm thinking I may have been right. That one, it can't be right. Because there's the other one. And that'll happen, so you got to be careful. I think this one is correct. Yep, there it is. So, now we got that guy in there. And it was this guy right here. Gonna go right here. So, 
that right there is what makes these puzzles interesting. Puzzles, mind teasers. I'm going with the box. Box says 3D crystal puzzles. <laughs> so, <laughs> I mean, what to each his own, I guess. You know, let's uh, see what we can come up with here. There we go. That's the next one right there. Let's see if I can. Still too big. Okay. Not had much sleep today, so I'm a little tired. Not yet. Not yet. It's got to be one of the arm pieces. that one. It's that one. Okay. Looking for a little guy. Is that possible? No, it's not possible. Okay, a little bit of a layering issue there. So, to find my way here, I had to first find this piece here, which went on. The problem with that was, is I think this piece here should have went on first, so, like that. Just like this. Yeah. Du, 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 du. Man, that looks so much right, but it's not. And of course, I'm doing this while nobody's home because it's quieter. Um, but it's also proven to be daylight out, so everything looks real shiny. So. Fix my camera here. There we go.
again the right side is proving to be a little more touchy about you know you have to find that side first I'm drying here. Hold on. There we go. It's also a little bit harder for me to rest my arm because I just got a tattoo done. So, let's see here. I'm going to go with this little guy here just because it looks right. Let's see if I'm right. Oh. Yep. Let's see what I'm working with here. No. Looks like our next one is this little guy here. Looks about right. I wonder what's kind of going on because these pieces don't look right. Oh, so right about now you're going to start seeing, I know it's kind of hard to see, but right there is the arm piece. So you're going to start seeing arm pieces appear here. little guy so right now I'm grabbing the arms one is gonna go right here the other is gonna go there so first of all, I'm going to find out what's going to cap these off. So, it's going to be littler pieces for sure. So there's this one. Yep, it's going to be this guy here. It's going to have a nice little firm, kind of flat, bladed side right there. And it's going to go on just like that. Means I'm looking for another flat bladed side. Kind of tiny. Is it you? No. I'm looking for something. Else, which is driving me crazy because it's uh, it has a flat bladed side to it. Oh, it is it. Oh, look at that. Okay. So you're gonna be looking at this one next. arm. I'm going with the, let me see here, 
I'm going to go with the left side for, or no, it's right side first. And then from the looks of it, we're going to be using the kind of a bottom of the jaw next. Just like that. Which this should make things a little simpler because we're going to be now trying to form the back of its head. So... So what I've done here is I found these two together, put them aside, next piece, it's going to give us again the layering issue but it tells us what piece we're looking for at the same time. right there yep okay so Again, be careful because as you can see, it is wobbling. You don't want to end up dropping it. And I'm going to guess that this is the next one. I'm not 100% sure just yet. But it looks right. And it is. Another big boy, huh? Well, let's take a look. Doesn't look like that bottom piece is got a nose to it, so I'm just gonna keep going with another idea here. Yeah, this is the right piece. It was upside down. And there's the next one, just like uh, it's coming together now. Everything's going a little quicker now, as you can see. I'm going to put this piece on next, just at the end of the nose with the eyeballs that we've been waiting on.
Next. Gonna have that one with the nubs on it. And I'm taking it, those are for the ears. Yep. Okay, so we are now towards the end. And I'm sorry again about all the wobbling. I'm gonna look into a stand or something that I can use for this because it does seem to work. Uh, as far as allowing you guys to see the upkeep on all this, but uh, I'd like for it not to be, you know, wobbling all over as much. So, um, I got the tail, got the ending piece, and then I got his head. So we're going to put his head on right now. I don't know if I can, the head piece. There goes one of his ears. Not theirs. Get, get back here. Get over here. There we go. Now, with these, I recommend you be very careful. Uh, anytime I do an anchor, it, I have to be careful because, yes, they do slide right down and in there. Once you start twisting, though, not that. Get back here. Thank you. If you're not careful as to how hard you tighten it down, you can break your anchor. And after all that work, you really don't want that. So let me see here. Loosen him up just a little bit for his tail. Put his tail back in. Slowly anchor it down. There we go. This one feels a little wobbly still, so I'm gonna see. I'm gonna see if it'll let me. It did. A little more at a time, but I'm not going any further because, like I said, I don't want to break it. So, on goes the head. <sighs> Looks like the ears are gonna be fun. If you experience this trouble, I recommend super glue. It does not a lot is needed. But it does do wonders. So there's that. And I'm going to now show you guys. Try to get some of the lighting down. There we go. So there we are. Nice. Another piece to my collection. Looks wonderful. The whole outlay of it. And we haven't even done the fun part yet. As you remember, when we first started, we had these guys here got some little eyeballs so let's go ahead and get them eyeballs on there we go Oh no, the nose fell off. Get some eyeballs. Cute little nose. I'm a little bit thrown back. I mean, yeah, on the thing here, he has the Red Bull. I mean, I like the Red Bull, but so many choices. So many choices. So i tell you what I'm going to do. Why don't you all kick me a comment as to what you think I should put right here, whether it be the Red Bull or if it should be like a Care Bear and have the, the heart on its belly or the star. I'll leave it up to you guys, and then I will – uh, go ahead, and that's what it's going to look like. But until then, as you can see with the light and everything, it looks very pretty with the crystal. I mean, it's just, it 
these things capture the light like something else. So that's what the guy looks like right there. And then you guys decide whoever I get, uh, whichever one I get the most comments about, whichever one I get the, uh, yeah, basically, yeah, just going with the most comments. Drop me a comment and let me know what you guys think I should get. Again, got two different hearts, what color you'd like, or I can do the bow ties or the, the star even. So go ahead and just let me know what you guys like. I'm going to get my camera here. And uh, we'll go ahead and we'll do that. So, again, you know, just drop me some comments. Let me know what you guys think. And finished product again. All right, guys. Well, that's been another episode. And I'll go ahead and I'll see you guys at the next one. All right. Until then, like I always tell you guys, stay frosty. All right.